Good evening, everyone. Recreational marijuana will soon be legal in Missouri. Voters approved Amendment 3 by 53%. But the provisions of that measure will not go into effect until December 8th. Brianna Harris tells us what to expect in the coming weeks. I was thrilled. I was so excited. Um, I knew what a great impact this was going to have. For Green Light Dispensary Manager Sarah Gunther Jackson, this vote to legalize marijuana in Missouri stands as a win for the community. The first thing I always think about um, on this is tax revenue. It is such a huge producer of tax revenue, um, not only for our state, but for our local communities as well. Um, you know, there are estimates as high as 40 million in tax revenue for. Um, our state alone just off of this. Katherine Jamboretz with Legal Missouri tells me how the process to officially legalize recreational marijuana will go. This law goes into effect 30 days from the vote. That means December 8th, it will be a law in Missouri. Then people are allowed to apply for licenses and that will have a certain process that any licensee can apply for. And then we're thinking roundabout the early to mid-February range will be when it will probably be available to customers. Beyond legalizing the use of marijuana, Amendment 3 also calls for changes in criminal law. One of the things that will immediately happen with this is expungement. That means if you're one of the 100,000 Missourians with a conviction for marijuana that is nonviolent on your record, it will be automatically cleared. You don't have to pay for it. You don't have to apply for it. It is absolutely automatic. The tax revenues from the sale of marijuana will pay for that. Jackson says restrictions still apply to the sale and use of marijuana. Safe access is such a huge thing um, for adults 21 and older to be able to purchase things in a facility where they know they've been tested and they have come from clean, safe facilities in the state of Missouri. Kate Gerardo, Brianna Harris, Heartland News.